I grabbed these three toilet plungers from the Dollar Tree and I'm just going to remove the rubber plunger from the wooden handle and then remove each sticker as well. Now these stickers can be pretty stubborn so you just apply a little bit of heat from your blow dryer and it helps lift up these stubborn stickers. I then grabbed my pizza pan from the Dollar Tree and I'm going to prime it first using the Stain Eliminating White Primer by Wise Owl and a Gen Foam Brush and I did give that two coats. This just helps the paint adhere better to the metal. I went back to my wooden handles and I gave them an angle cut using my table saw. I want to say it was a 45 degree angle cut. I then took my Wise Owl black paint and I painted all three of the wooden handles. And then I set those aside to dry. I went back to my pizza pan in a smaller circle and I'm just using that to mark three dots that form the shape of a triangle. And I'm going to take a small screw and this is really easy to screw through. You can also pre-drill if you want to. And I'm going to screw the wood handles from the toilet plungers onto the bottom of my pizza pan. And you want to make sure that you adhere it so that the wood handle is flat to the bottom of the pizza pan. You want that angle cut laying flat. So now we have three legs on our pizza pan. I have another wood circle because I want to hide the screws on the top. And I'm going to paint that with the Wise Owl white snow owl paint. And when that was dry, I then took my Wise Owl One Hour Enamel Clear and applied that to my wood circle. I decided to paint the top of the pizza pan with the Krylon Shortcut black spray paint, and I allowed that to dry. I got these stickers from Target. I'm going to find the center of my circle. And these stickers were in the craft section, and they are like a clear with this really pretty black design and they're in the shape of a square I believe they're meant to be like tile stickers and I'm going to lay them on top of my circle now I did the one hour enamel clear because this just helps the sticker adhere better and then I'm going to rub it in really good I took a razor blade to just go around the outside of the circle to remove any extra that was hanging off the edges here. Once my pizza pan was dry, I took a popsicle stick and laid it just in the center and then laid the circle on top of that. This just helped it adhere better to the center. And now we just have this really cute, easy Dollar Tree accent table. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Paint products, tissue paper, transfers, and mesh stencils can all be found on our webpage at chalkitupfancy.com. And don't forget, you can also check out other tutorials over on our webpage. Have a great day.